What's up guys, welcome to today's video. And you know, I've started doing this thing on my TikTok recently where I rate people's home screen setups. So in the community Discord, I have this whole channel dedicated to people just submitting screenshots of what their home screen looks like. And we get some pretty cool ones actually. But then yesterday I got this submission and it was from someone named Solar. And like everybody loved it, including myself. I think it's amazing. And so I figured this would be a good opportunity for me to teach you guys how you can customize your home screen to look something like this, or I mean, even just however you wanna make it yourself. And there's literally like an endless amount of possibilities of how you could personalize your home screen, but I'm gonna give a specific tutorial for this one, and then hopefully that can give you some ideas for your own. Or you can just copy this one because it's so cool. So to customize our home screen today, we are going to be using a launcher. And this launcher is called Nova Launcher. And it's actually what I use to make my personal home screen as well. And so you'll open up the Play Store, search for Nova Launcher and install it. And once it's finished downloading, just go to your home screen and a pop-up will come up asking you to set it as your default launcher. Now the pop-up didn't come up for me since I already did that, but it should come up for you. Now to recreate Solar's home screen, there are a few more downloads that you actually need. And so to make it easy, I just posted it in the community Discord so that you guys can just download them. And so if you're not already a part of the community Discord, just scroll down to the description of this video and there's a link for you to join. And so in there, I made a new channel called Home Screen Downloads. And in that, there are downloads for the widgets, the icons, the wallpaper, and the Nova Launcher backup file, which I'll talk about here in a minute. So right now I'm gonna go ahead and just download this wallpaper. And then I'm gonna download this white icon pack called a white log. And then we got the widgets. These ones are called Timeless and they are honestly so cool, but unfortunately they do cost money. And as you can see, I already have it, but it costs 99 cents, which isn't too bad. However, it does get a little more complicated than that, which is kind of weird. So you'll open the timeless widgets and then you'll see you just have like a huge selection of different widgets you can choose from. And so all of these widgets are labeled and the one that Solar uses is this one right here, it's SD8. But then here's the weird thing, when you actually go to install it, it redirects you to download another app to be able to install it, which, which is weird, I, I don't know. And so you'll hit install and this app is free. However, to be able to actually use it, you have to get the pro version, which is $5.99. And so, yeah, that's not the best thing in the world, but I mean, it's like $7 total to be able to fully customize your home screen. So, I mean, if you're somebody who's into that, then I mean, it's worth it. And so once you've finished installing those, you can then scroll down and download the Nova Launcher backup file. And so this is just a backup file of exactly what Solar has his whole setup as in Nova Launcher. So it'll just copy everything over, which is really nice. And once it's downloaded, just go ahead and open it up and it's gonna ask you to restore that backup file. And so now you can see that we kind of have an outline of what everything's supposed to look like, but you can see we're missing this widget. This is just like a filler. We're missing this widget, which is a filler, and we're missing the wallpaper. So we have to add those ones. And so go ahead and hold down the home screen, choose a wallpaper, and then just choose the one that we downloaded. And now we're actually almost done. We just have to fill in these widgets. So you'll just tap the widget placeholder and it'll open up that second app that we downloaded. And then you just gotta find the widget. And so there is a search bar in the top. So just go ahead and search for it. It's called SD8. And so there it is, just tap it and then it'll add that to your home screen. And so by default, the text is white, but it does have an editor so that you can change that. And so to open up the editor, you'll just tap the widget and it'll bring you right there. And then at the bottom, you're gonna scroll over to globals and then you'll just change both of these text options to black. And then we'll hit save at the top. And now that widget is totally good to go. Now we just need this one at the bottom, which is a music player. So tap the placeholder right there. And the title of this one is T Music One. So just search for that. And so here it is right there. So tap that. And then you can actually just go ahead and hit save. And so now both of the widgets are there and good to go. However, they are a little small compared to how Solar had it in his. And so you don't have to change the size of them, but I'm gonna go ahead and do that. So just tap the widget and then it'll bring up the editor. Then you're gonna go to layer and it just gives you a scaling option. And so I brought it up to 85.5. So let's save that and see how it looks. And that looks pretty good, but now let's uh, resize this one. And I brought that one up to 37.1 and that looks pretty good and we're done. And wow, that looks so good. 
But anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. I hope this was informative or helpful in some way. And if you would leave a like on the video, it would be amazing. If not, I'll forgive you. It'll be all right. <laughs> but I will go ahead and leave a link to Solar's YouTube channel in the description of this video. So huge shout out to him. His wallpaper and home screen is all amazing. So go subscribe. But yeah, guys, you guys are amazing. Have a great day. <laughs> Bye.